What you overcame to win the Universal title was amazing. I'm so proud of you, Buzz. And I know I haven't gotten a single response from you in almost a year, but I'm going to keep calling and I'm going to keep on texting because I still have hope that we can someday patch things up. Anyway, until then, know that I'm in your corner from a distance. Well, he's done it, ladies and gentlemen. There is no bigger story right now to discuss than Buzz winning the Universal title. And this was no fluke, okay? He won the title in an Elimination Chamber match where he was the first entrant along with none other than Braun Strowman. Uh, when you take a step back, it's truly remarkable to think about what Buzz has accomplished in such a short amount of time. I mean, if it feels like he just got to the WWE, it's because he did. Uh, in fact, in preparing for today's show, I looked at some of the names that have climbed to the top of the mountain in record speed like Buzz now has. Uh, I mean, we're talking some heavy hitters here, folks. Hall of Fame-level talent. The Undertaker, he won his first world title a little over a year after making his WWE debut. That was longer than it took Buzz. Kurt Angle? Took him less than a year to win the title, but still longer than Buzz. There are a few guys you might have heard of that did it just a little bit faster. Big Show, Kane, Brock Lesnar, and, uh, oh, and a guy by the name of Ric Flair. I mean, that's pretty good company, if you ask me. But if I have one piece of advice for the new champion, it's that just because people like me can now mention you in the same breath as those legends, it does not mean you're their equal yet, all right? One win does not define a career. So celebrate the moment, but be ready, because uh, it's only going to get harder from now on. If you thought there was a target on your back before, <laughs> it's now a hundred times bigger with that universal title strapped around your waist. Uh, success breeds jealousy from all corners of your life, and uh, I'd also be willing to bet that none of this is going to sit well with Triple H, who by all accounts is feeling a bit perturbed to say the least. Uh, good luck, Buzz, and congrats on your first universal title reign, which if all goes well, I am sure will be the first of many.
Singles action is up next. You're not going to want to miss this. We have one of our breakout talents against Braun Strowman. And this one is going to be good. That music can mean only one thing. It's Buzz! Making his way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 205 pounds, the WWE Universal Champion, Eddie Draven. Did you guys see the WWE 24 episode about Buzz? I highly recommend it. Yeah, you also highly recommend a sushi joint when we're in Topeka. I think I'm gonna pass. trembling with each step. I would do anything not to get stuck inside the ring with Braun Strowman. Oh, Byron, I would pay all of my bank account to watch you get these hands. Well, quiet, quiet. I don't want them to hear you. Yeah, you start to feel like there's nothing Braun Strowman can't do. Well, there is one thing we know for a fact Braun Strowman can't do, and that is be stopped. The monster among men is unbelievable. And we're underway. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. If you haven't hit record yet, oh. now might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. The monster among men Man. doesn't ask for permission nor ask for forgiveness. He simply destroys whatever lays in his path. Braun Strowman is a leviathan, Saxton. And sports entertainment has never experienced brute force like this from one human being. Back in the ring now. Oh, from behind. His shoulders are down. He got body on body there, but that's about it. Not yet. Too early. He gets him with the overhand punch. Firmly in the driver's seat after that slam. He's starting to stagger a bit. I fully expect him to bounce back, though. This is the type of one-on-one -on -one atmosphere where he thrives. Wow. I know it's early, but he has to do everything in his power not to let this get out of hand. He's really putting his athleticism on display here. Oh, my God! Oh, oh. driver! Spiked him. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. And he's heading back in. Down he goes. That'll do it every time. Braun 
Roman oh, faltering some. He's going to want to make sure this doesn't snowball out of control. Well, he had to expect to take some punishment oh. tonight. You don't step in the ring with this guy and walk away completely unscathed. This oh. match is so evenly contested right now that it's almost impossible to pick a winner. I guess we'll just have to settle in and enjoy the action. Oh, nice. boy, he is rolling. And he has a big-time drop kick. Look at this. He's going back to an old friend with that one. He's not going to like this. See if he takes the bait. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. He's going to do it. What a combination. You just don't know what's coming next. We need to capitalize on it now. Seems to me, guys, like we're just moments away from seeing the finisher, which could obviously put this match on ice. I just can't get over the physicality of this match. This has been brutal. The finisher could absolutely end this match, Michael, as you were saying, but it's not a guarantee. Sometimes it takes two or even three to get the job done, and even then, it's not a sure bet, a la Randy Savage versus The Ultimate Warrior at WrestleMania 7. That's my favorite match of all time. Randy Savage landed an amazing five top rope elbow drops but was still unable to put Warrior away. And you know what? He probably could have hit him with five more. There was just no stopping the Warrior on that. Take it off his feet here. And it's moves like that that make him so dangerous. When this guy's on, look out. He's in trouble. He doesn't look too eager to get up, and I don't blame him. And Buzz brings everyone to their fate. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Things just went. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Looking for an opening for that finisher, it seems. And that's a smart move. Just hit the finisher, get the win, and get out of there. Oh, Buzz just barely got out of the way. Anytime a superstar sees an opening for their finisher, they got to take it, as Byron was saying. Elongating the match not only gives your opponent an opportunity to get back in it, but you're also running the risk of injury anytime you're in the ring longer than you have to be. Yeah, but sometimes you just enjoy beating somebody up, especially if you're in the ring with somebody like Saxton. Things are not looking very good right now. Gonna have to find a way to regroup. And now he goes for it a second time. Here it comes, he's got him. If he sticks this, he is done. How are these superstars even still going, guys? I mean, they have to be on fumes right now. He's got to hurry if he doesn't want to get counted out here. Time's certainly not on his side, Michael. Caught him with a big boot. On the mark. Nice job getting out of the way of that one. Driven back down to the mat with unbelievable power. He's almost got him. He wants no part of the outside. Nicely done. Mm -hmm. Got some air on that senton, guys. Yeah, if he hits this, the match is over. Showing off his quick hands. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. He knows he's in trouble. The end is near for him. 
He hits it, Bunch brings everyone to their feet. I don't remember the last time I saw Strowman manhandled like this. Things look dire for Braun Strowman. Johnny dodges out of the way. He's playing with him now. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. He's making a statement here with this attack. Braun Strowman is getting ready here. Oh, Braun Strowman slamming into the mat. And there it is, boys. Yeah, here's a cover. Buzz with the easy kick out. Just when you thought it was over. Wow. Look at Braun Strowman stalking him. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. Great officiating. As the ref noticed, he was on the ropes. The longer this fight goes on, the more wear and tear on each competitor. Who is going to have enough to pick up the win? Just a step quicker, it looks like. When this guy's on, look out. Here we go again. I don't remember the last time I saw Strowman manhandled like this. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about gonna... to find out. Oh, he's going to do it. He hits it. Buzz brings everyone to their feet. I don't remember the last time I saw Strowman manhandled like this. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. Oh, he's going to do it. He's always had the ability to take it up a notch. Look out. Braun Strowman is measuring. Completely dominating. But can Strowman follow up here? They tapped out. That's the match. And here's a look back at some of the action from the previous match. There's good, there's great, and then there's downright Maybe unbelievable WWE Whoa. action. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, you just got a taste of the unbelievable kind. Now that's eking out a win. I can't. Take a look at that. Looks good, doesn't it? But let's be honest. That didn't look very good for me at the Elimination Chamber. Because thanks to Triple H doing everything in his power to hold me down yet again, not only did I have to defeat Braun Strowman, I had to do it in an Elimination Chamber match against five other superstars where I had to enter first with the Monster Among Men. But despite all of that, I overcame the odds and stand here as your new Universal Champion! So, what's next? Well, here we go again. Buzz can't catch a break. I hate to admit it, but what you said is true. I have done everything in my power to keep this moment from happening, and it didn't work. I wouldn't be where I am if I didn't have a plan B. Or C, or D, or E. You see, I have done everything in my power to stop you except for bringing back the most powerful force in sports entertainment. So you've left me with no choice. It's time for plan E. It's time for evolution. Are you 
kidding me? Evolution is back. This is not good for Buzz. Triple H has sent a powerful message to Buzz that he will go to any lengths to destroy his career. After what Evolution did to Buzz tonight, it might already be destroyed. We've been wondering all week how Buzz would respond to Evolution's attack, and it looks like we're about to Sir, find I'm out. I'm going to have to ask you to stop right there. You think we're playing here? I don't want to have to hurt you. Ow! After the beating he took last week, he'd be better off staying on the bus. Knowing this guy, I don't think that's going to happen. Is Evolution even inside that limo? I don't know, but it looks like Buzz is determined to find out. Ugh. Triple H from behind with a sledgehammer. Spinning kick to the gut. And they're ready to do battle in the back. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. Uh, yeah. Got him good with a neck breaker. Looks like he's pinpointing the back. He's calling for it. Better stay right where he is. Oh my yeah. god. Unbelievable flip right there. Oh, oh. oh, he goes low. You're not cheating, you're not trying. it for the second time now. You better stay right where he is. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. Oh, he's going to do it. Yeah. Oh. Triple H, look at it. Down. Like being manhandled by a bear. He's in the driver's seat now. Jeez, I felt that one over here. And he goes up and over. What coordination and control. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Triple H. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. He'd be wise to stay right there. <laughs> what does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find. It's got to be hard to rebound from that one. Will Buzz be able to continue? I doubt it. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're about to find out. Oh, he's going to do it. Fisherman driver. Good night. The game getting absolutely punished right now. What a moonsault. He landed it. 
He knows he's in trouble. He's teetering on the edge here. Whoa, Triple H dodged that one. Neck breaker. And now Randy Orton and Batista attack buzz from behind. We should have known these two would get involved. This certainly looks like a setup now. Oh no. Buzz is trapped in there. This is taking things way too far. No, no, no. We need some medical help back there immediately. It's going to take a lot of work to just get him out of the limo. I can't believe Triple H and Evolution resorted to something like this. Welcome to Monday Night Raw, where if you missed the updates on social media throughout the week, we're happy to inform you that Buzz miraculously escaped last week's limo crash without suffering any major injuries. He may not have suffered any serious injuries, but our Universal Champion looks nowhere near 100% after what Evolution did last week. He's in no condition to be out here. He should have just stayed home to recover. I don't think that's in his DNA. Well, then he needs a gene transplant. Now, I'm not out here to make some long speech about everything Triple H has done to me this past year. No. I'm only out here for one thing tonight. Revenge. Evolution. I know you're back there. And I'm not leaving this ring until you come out and face me. I gotta hand it to you, Buzz. You are resilient. I mean, you survived a high-speed limo crash, and the very next week, you're right back out here looking for a fight. But it seems that for all the guts you have, you're a bit lacking in the intelligence department. Because if you haven't noticed, we have a three-on-one advantage, and I think we all know from the last couple of weeks how that's going to turn out. You know, I may be a bit stubborn sometimes, but I'm not stupid. If anything, Triple H, you've taught me that I can't always do everything on my own. So that's why I decided to even the playing field just a little bit. We saw Buzz team up with Finn Balor in his battles against Bray Wyatt, and now Finn is here once again to have his back. Okay, so you have one other guy. Big deal. We still outnumber you. It's AJ Styles from SmackDown Live! What's he doing here? Obviously, Buzz reached out for backup. Now I'd say it's a little more even. You should know this is far from over. At WWE Fastlane, it will be Evolution versus the three of you. Wow, that is a match I never thought we'd see. Yeah, that is a dream match if there ever was one. There are the three men who will team tonight to take on the reunited Evolution. It's going to be quite the challenge for the new group, the Buzzkills. Well, did you come up with that name, Byron? No, I can't take credit for that. Well, I wouldn't want to either.
I've been part of clubs before, so I know about their weaknesses. There's always one or two members looking out for themselves, so we can exploit that tonight and defeat Evolution. <laughs> Knowing those guys? All of them. I don't care about all that. Besides, if Triple H wasn't going for you, he'd be coming after me or Finn. So all that matters is we put an end to this power trip tonight. Hey, it just goes to show you never know what will happen. So you need to be prepared for anything. Same goes for tonight. Making his way to the ring at a combined weight of 613 pounds, Eddie Draven, the phenomenal AJ Styles, and Finn Balor. Is it me or is this guy's 15 minutes of fame expired? I think it's just you because just like a good mattress, Buzz's success seemingly has no expiration date. Is that why our chairs have bed bugs, Saxton? and the tag team titles. You factor in the nature boy, Ric Flair, into the evolution mix. You're talking about 49 combined world championships. That is an unbelievable statistic. But when you're staring at these three men, it's no surprise that evolution is one of the greatest factions of all time. Yeah, and a faction that has stood the test of time. A faction that came together 10 years after those accomplishments of world titles, intercontinental titles, tag team titles, and picked up right where they left off. 